Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. Today's video is basically going to show you what do you get when you cross a Lego EV3 robot with pool noodles. If you want to see this, stay with me. And after watching this video, if you like what you see, go ahead and hit that subscribe button right there. Come on, I know you can do it. So some of you have been asking me to build some type of train. And I said, hey, what about a monorail type robot? So I basically went to Walmart and got these pool noodles. I couldn't believe these things are 25 cents. What a bargain. I mean, gee, can they really make this for less than a quarter? Anyway. I took these pool noodles and I basically thought, hmm, I'm wondering if a robot could basically run along this pool noodle, kind of like a monorail. So today's video, I'm going to basically show you what I built and then I'm going to show you the, I'm going to call it the pool noodle runner because it basically runs along this pool noodle. So let's first go ahead and go to the build and then I'm going to show you the noodle pool, the pool noodle runner. Okay, everybody, there is the pool noodle runner. And I basically um, had to put these large motors just far enough so that it could go on top of the noodle and then basically just run on top of it. Um, you're gonna have to help me out, guys. I was hoping to maybe curve the track a little bit, but I just couldn't figure out a way to curve pool noodles and connect them all at the same time and still run the robot on it. So there might be a pool noodle runner video too if I can figure out how to curve them. But for today, they're just going to be straight pool noodles. So let's go ahead and see how this thing was built. What I plan to do is basically just um, take pictures and basically show you every step that I took to get this thing built. So if you're ready, here we go. Okay, now that the pool noodle robot is ready, let's watch it run. I just learned that if you want to connect two pool noodles together, I just took um, a gift wrap tube, I guess it could be a toilet paper tube also, and I just squished it, and you can actually connect your pool noodles like that. And you just take your pool noodle robot and just put it on the pool noodle. Look at him go.
guys. So the pool noodle robot, this guy is awesome. It's just really cool, like a monorail type robot where it just travels along this pool noodle tube. And it's really cool. Um, again, I'm gonna try to get these things to be curved because it'd be cool to you know curve the track for this guy. So nope, I'm not gonna take this guy quite yet. I'm gonna still mess around with this pool noodle because it's still summer. It still feels like, you know, we can go out and put this in the pool. No, not the robot, the pool noodle. Um, but anyway, hopefully you, uh, from the directions or my pictures, you were able to build this guy. And again, only 25 cents at Walmart. You can't beat that deal um, to just get more pool noodles. So the next time I go to Walmart, I'm gonna try to have to buy more of these and make my track longer. Okay guys, so hopefully you liked the pool noodle runner and it's a really cool robot. Okay guys, I am Mr. Hino from Mission Zyga Robotics. I'm out. He's out. He's out. We got this. We got this. We got this guys. Hey guys, Mr. Hino here. Thank you so much for watching. And if you love robotics, don't forget to check out these videos also because they're cool. Okay guys, take care.